So, hi all, my mind is blown up from electronic things. Okay, never mind, I will try to overcome my problems. So, what do I got here? This is something a little different and interesting uh, as I find it. This is an inverter that is suitable for any LED up to 40 watt. It gives out 110 to 240 volt AC and it is using lithium ion battery, which is not lithium phosphate, but something similar. It's lithium iron something, so it should be safe. Duration three hours. Okay, I will show you what it is doing. So we have here the backup battery as it came. So let's see how it looks like. It looks like this. So we have four cells, uh, or to be more precise, we have eight cells. We have two in parallel connected to two in parallel to two in parallel and to two. So overall we have eight cells. And these cells should be connected to this unit and I will show you how to connect this unit. I've already prepared wires. So we have here the uh, outlet. This is connected to 220 volt. Of course, do not do it if you are not familiar with electricity and never connect it before you connect all the wires to the unit itself and be safe and take care. Okay, so we have here uh, the earth. So you just press it. I like this press uh, connection. They are much uh, better than the one with the screws if it is working nicely. And then we have the neutral wire. So the neutral should be connected here something like this and then we have the live and the live I've already splitted the live because it should be connected also with a switch because you can light with the switch and without the switch on emergency it will light without the switch so this is the trigger to the on off and then we have the LED itself I've connected here I think it is a 15 watt light LED yes this is 15 watt from Nisco so here we have the neutral and uh, the face for the light itself the lamp itself should be for LED light so now I will show you how it works it is not working even if I will connect the battery it shouldn't work yet ah there was a spark so now I will be careful, see that nothing is shorting. It looks fine to me. Now we'll connect it to the outlet. Nothing explodes. This is very good design. So we have here a green light which shows, I think, that the battery is charged. And we have here a test to test the lamp. Yes, and it is working. This is, I think, it should be checking, ah yes, it should be checking the light in real condition like it is not connected to the outlet. Right now it is connected to the outlet here. You can see it. And now I have the on off switch that I can manually turn on off the light. But even if it is off and now I will disconnect it from the outlet, then it will start to run from the batteries so let's see if this is working yes this is working so what is nice about this circuit that it should be suitable for any LED uh, lamp that you have at home that you wish to convert it to emergency option so if you will have problem in the power supply for your home it will automatically run on the batteries. And this is very nice uh, because this is 15 watt and we have a 4500 milliamp hour battery. It should run at least for four and 
uh, 4.5 hours with this battery because I think it will consume 1 amp and the voltage here is nearly 15 volts so it's exactly 15 watt so it should run for four and a half hours and of course during the connection to the outlet the battery is always charged and this is how the battery is kept charging and when we have an emergency like now so it will automatically run on the batteries so that's all for now Hope you enjoy, thank you, and see you next time. Bye.